the visionary leadership in manufacturing program is now in its 10th year and has produced about 300 students through this program the primary purpose of this program as we defined in the beginning is to provide a set of resources who are specifically trained for the manufacturing industry so we started the program with about 30 students and then now the program graduates about 40 students uh, who take part in this program by going to three institutions and are able to get the best of three institutions can offer. One of the unique features is that all the students who come out of this program have prayer experience and the main idea was and is to take people with experience who bring experience to the classroom and then augment it with knowledge and the experience of going through different institutions and interacting with different organizations which essentially adds to their own strength in terms of knowledge and experience and to give it back to the manufacturing industry from where they came. I would say the initial years when we did not have this much of an analytics boom, the program was slightly oriented towards manufacturing, manufacturing completely. But now we are able to make smaller or minor changes to help both the manufacturing and the services industry. And we believe that that's going to be the thing of the future. The emphasis on analytics has increased a little bit. Analytics being the buzzword today and used extensively both in manufacturing and in service. What we do in IIT Madras is to concentrate on the operations management or the industrial engineering component of the course. And some of the courses here include total quality management, manufacturing systems management, supply chain management, data analysis with specific emphasis on analytics and so on. The advantage is the flavor that three institutions give uh, where the students get a combination of a qualitative treatment on certain courses and a quantitative treatment on certain others. I would possibly say that the IIT Madras courses have a lot more quantitative flavor. Concentrating a lot more on modeling manufacturing systems and modeling issues in operations management. Every organization, be it manufacturing or service, has a role for forecasting, planning and scheduling, which essentially happen to be the three pillars of operations management. And if you add quality, it get, you get the four pillars. So the courses here concentrate on these. Be it, as I said, a manufacturing or a service organization, the, the quantitative models, the methods and methodologies that are covered through these courses helps the VLM student to quickly adapt himself or herself to meet the requirements and with the work experience they possess can do it faster and better than a student who comes out of any management program fresh. This I think is a very special unique thing and as a program I also believe it's unique in the sense it could go down or could claim as the first exclusive program for manufacturing management conceived with the intention or with the aim to meet the growing manufacturing industry in this country and help in all possible ways for manufacturing in India to grow. Today there is no manufacturing without management. 
every manufacturing system or every manufacturing organization has a lot of management coming in, in as i said in terms of operations supply chain and analytics and i believe this program provides the students with adequate training both on the qualitative and quantitative aspects that would help the manufacturing industry and we believe in the years to come the number of students that this program graduates will increase and they will occupy higher positions in the decision making in manufacturing in this country